And then you know birds, right? Pigeons do what? They shit. Is this near uh, Orchard Cine Leisure? Uh, yeah, pretty near. Of course, Baski, I tell you, the pigeons <laughs> at Cine Leisure, uh, I don't know what they eat, no. <laughs> they really shit like crazy. <laughs> Alright guys, will you all buy uh, tissue paper from like those old people or handicapped people? Hmm, I don't usually do it eh. I mean I've, I've given them money lah, but I don't usually buy tissue. Mm. I think I will lah. But then if they are lining up with like, you know sometimes they got like a lot in this street right? Unfortunately not for the rest lah, just buy from the first one then chow. Oh, yeah. oh you mean like those uh, golf Yeah, yeah, yeah golf So choosing your position important <laughs> <laughs> I remember the dog in PLQ, the, they got give you a free tissue, keep me good and take <laughs> 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 That one is not when you make it basket. You don't end up. That one is because they are marketing, like they are, you know, like flyers. Like, I remember it's free. They, they are not, they are not those handicapped people. Uh, okay, I will not ever exploit those people. <laughs> <laughs> I went to take a tissue. Then after that, I go on corner, I put on my bag, I go and take. Then I go on my bag, I change my hair, change my shirt, then I go and take. <laughs> I want to test the system, see how many I can take. This is the super a lot, the cheap one. Yeah, but the, like the fourth or fifth time, right? then like, eh? <laughs> you know, this like, I'm the same person. Eh? Have I seen you before? Actually, I, I would eh, for me, I would. Every single one uh, Not every single one uh, Let's say I'm eating and I and when you're eating, you need tissue right? They come to me, I would lah, uh, if I have money. Uh, then like, last time I used to, you know those people that like the, the deaf, mm. they come and put the oh. cut to your table. Yeah, they sell kitchen. That's how I'll, I'll, I'll buy one. I'll buy, but I, I never support them. I they never want $10 them. or something? $5, $5. $5, $5. Uh. Then, the, 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 the $10, they increase their price. In, inside pocket, 5 $5 go to their... I'm like, yes. Oh, so that's that's the reason why I don't support them. After that, I realized that because I used to I used to do this, so I used to go around the blocks to sell keychains. Key and I realized the money I make, uh, I make is like sick money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is the deep but wait, you uh, pay for money? No, oh. but they, they, uh, no. I, I got this. Oh. <laughs> I, okay, uh, it's bad. But last time I got this um police report thing. This I don't know. It's a how say is this a cert uh, a cert that say that oh I just. I just come out from jail. Right? jail. <laughs> Wait, where did you get it from? Oh, yeah. huh? It's from it's a uh, it's a illegal one from like the. Oh, I see scam people. Yeah. Uh, number yeah. one scammer. The moment I realized this had was happening, when I stopped buying it because mm. there was one shirt I buy. After basket, I go Geylang, Gay to play like in that cafe. Right, I saw the exact same guy. Was he was just playing, enjoying, enjoying his life, mm, yeah, playing like, computer, yeah. eating supper and stuff like that. Like. Yeah. You know the, the sad part about this right is there are recruiters who try to find all these people yes. so that they can get half of it. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, that, that's sad but what's sad is right is like people no longer trust these people. Mm. Like the yeah. people who really need help. Yeah. Mm. So then it's like once bitten twice shy. Oh. <coughs> but if I see those that legit like um they have some disabilities or they are really old right mm. I will try to support them mm. okay so let me uh, talking about disability or like really old you will support them let me show you a video okay of uh, this guy okay so this is the old man uh, he's sitting outside orchard okay so will y'all give like uh, okay he's selling tissue la, so will y'all like get tissue from him I wouldn't I, la. I, I don't know me. I wouldn't okay just 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 solely come to the point I like because you know, now COVID, the, right, the case is rising, and he's not even wearing a mask and he's coughing like mad. I don't think I'll go near him. That's the place they fall. Yeah. I think I would. You would, uh. mm. If I walk past, like, if I manage to walk past, like. Oh, so happy, uh, this old Magnanimous <laughs> Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> no, because it's just one dollar, uh, I mean. Yeah. Hey, what Robin Hood! Yeah. Steal from the rich, give the poor! Oh, like Robin Hood, oh. huh? Yeah, so Nowadays it's no longer $1, right? It's $1, sometimes $1, sometimes $2, Two depends on how many packets. $2, yeah. $2 if they give wet tissue, okay lah. Okay, right, right. Wet right. tissue. They, they I, never, never I, never before, I have never buy before yeah. wet tissue. Yeah. No, what? 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 I don't have, yeah. Got people give wet tissue on eh. I never buy wet tissue. Like premium wet tissue. The wet tissue is sure not then after that it's up to you. <laughs> yeah, so okay, for this uncle, right, actually a lot of people who walk past Orchard Road, right, keep giving him a lot of money. Mm -hmm. So, but what's frustrating, right, actually, uh, uh, the past few days, actually, there was this one lady, she wrote in to SG Gossip, and then she wanted us to care, uh, to share this story. Like, why? Mm -hmm. It's because, right, apparently the people around the area mm -hmm. who's working there, people who works in UOB, works in, like, just the shop around, yeah, around uh, the Orchard Road, mm -hmm. just that, that, uh, that stretch where the uncle is, 
they are all very, very angry and frustrated with him. Mm. And why? Yeah, why is because, right, he has been doing a lot of things that is, uh, like, harass the workers there. La. So, for example, one thing, right, is he actually um did this. Let me show you. Sexual. So, Ooh. this is one of the things that he did. So, if you can see, Feeding the pigeons. Uh. Yeah, he's feeding the pigeons. And then one came, Yella. more came. They attract all. Uh. So he is becoming a public nuisance. Eh? Yeah, so so the people, why did I say the people who are working there, right? They are very upset, right? It's because they are cleaners, you know, who take care mm, of the building, the, streets, the uh. streets, right? And then they have people who are like walking across, mm. like pass by him. Uh. They say that it's really hard for them to clean because there are a lot of rice. And then, you know, birds, right? Pigeons do what? They shit. Is this near uh, Orchard Cine Leisure? Uh, yeah, pretty near. Because Baski, I tell you, the pigeons <laughs> at Cine Leisure, uh, I don't know what they eat, no. <laughs> they really shit like crazy. It's not just that, no. Where are you before? No, where are the cows? Yeah, the yeah, amount yeah, yeah. of birds there. Yeah, it's crazy. crazy. You know when they go like, like 6 pm, you can't even hear people talking, it's just the birds chopping yeah, and chopping yeah, and chopping. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, this after just being inconsiderate, you know. And so and I tell you what's frust what's frustrating, right? Is that uh, you know they call police, they make police cool. reports, uh, they make a uh, like a complaint to mm. Comcare. So Comcare is uh like an organization who comes and like help this kind of uh, people who are like low income, mm. you know that, mm. that yeah. But the thing is, right? So the police came, give him sanitizer, ask him to go away, uh, give him mask, all this, right? He he just at the day not he go to one corner and then he come back again. Mm. The Comcare guys came down, realized that he actually has a family, and the family actually asked him to go home, but he doesn't want. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he's not homeless, lah. He's not homeless. He probably makes a lot of money doing this, lah. Yes. So you know, there's a bank behind. Mm -hmm. The UOB bank is behind, right? Apparently, I heard there's some uh lady who came out and say that this uncle every two to three days will go into that bank and then deposit every time. A few hundreds. Wow! Super yeah. convenient. Eh? A few days, a few hundreds. Uh, this lady who told me, right, she said that this guy, uh, he's earning more than any one of us easily. Don't be surprised. I would, I would be surprised. surprised. Yeah. Because well, usually, usually a lot of like 100 plus mm. or more than that. Mm, mm. If times like that. Hey. 3K, oh. no. What are your superpowers again? I'm rich. So, one more thing, right, that he's doing, right, is it's super annoying to the people around there. Okay, let me show you guys. You pee there! No la, no be pee, pee there! there. No pee la. What the I hell man! My man! <laughs> this guy is what Joseph will turn into no? <laughs> okay now I don't need to see him pee so long. He gives zero fucks about his environment. You know how many videos wow. of this I have? Of he peeing in the different locations. Oh la, different and angles ah. Different <laughs> locations. <laughs> you know he peed outside this bank also la. One of the biggest uh, this guy is a real nuisance. You man. know what's the worst thing or not? And now the pandemic is so bad, right? He's holding what, you know? He's holding tissues. Mm. Because he's selling tissues, right? Mm. He passed to them. To yes, them. people buy from him. He's holding the tissue. This this video itself, he's holding tissue. Then the next video actually I have, right? He he sold it to someone who kindly buy it from him. Go, Joseph, go and buy his tissue. Oh.